Salam, I'm Jamshid Al Jamshidi, and this is a Mideast Minute. Villagers, thank you for tuning in as always from the Middle East today as we broadcast to you live from Omaha, the hometown of a number of peacekeepers. With Donald Trump's election win leading to worries our borders will close, it's time for the Middle East to realize that immigrating to the United States is overrated. The United States, a nation built by immigrants, when making it was as easy as boarding a ship, but no more. Making it in modern America is hard. So hard, in fact, that immigrating to America is the last thing you'd want. First of all, according to The Economist, housing prices in the United States are nearing an all-time high. And if you can't afford to buy a house, what are you going to do? As Fox's David Asman explains, it's not as if people are trying to just give them away. The houses in Detroit were, were literally being sold for a dollar each, and now they can't even give houses away. Yes, exactly. People are trying to just give them away. But what good is a house if you have no job? According to the Bureau of Labor Statistics, the unemployment rate in the United States is at 4.6%, which sounds very low, but is actually 84% higher than 1953, which means jobs are difficult to come by. Just listen to this business owner on KCRA. Could you use more workers? Uh, definitely. There's a real shortage right now, especially skilled workers. Yes, exactly. There is an urgent need for workers. But what good is a job and a house without food on your plate? According to the U.S. government's National Integrated Drought Information Systems, droughts are currently affecting 26% of the United States, devastating farmland and making food hard to come by. Alison Aubrey at PBS reports. 40% of all the food produced in the United States never gets eaten. Yes, exactly. The United States has so much food, even droughts aren't an issue. But is that the kind of country you want to immigrate to? One with houses to give, jobs in abundance, and so much food we throw tons in the trash? <laughs> that sounds awful. And regardless, villagers, we barely have space. We're packed to the gills. You'd last a week in New York before you wished you'd never left the wide open vistas you call home. I'm Jamshid Al Jamshidi, and this has been a Mideast Minute. <laughs>